Hey guys, Buddy Minecraft Heat here, and um, today I just wanted to show you one quick thing. Um, so I've been looking, and nowhere is there a video on how to um, expand the memory of your PlayStation. Or, I mean, there's videos on how to exp expand the memory on the original PlayStation 3. But I could find none on the PlayStation 3 Slim Edition. Uh, so I just started looking around, toying with one that, keep in mind, doesn't work anymore. And I found this out. If you look on the bottom of the system, there's a little switch here, or a little cover. Pull that up, and there's a screw inside. Take a screwdriver, get it in there, nice and good. Loosen that up. Sorry, it's switching directions. I'm looking through the camera, but it keeps leaning. Catch the screwdriver. See, it's a little itty bitty screw, so we're gonna put that over here for now. Then you can just go on ahead and close that up. And then, it's really dusty. I've already done this and cleaned out the system on the inside. Right here, where it says uh, Blu ray, DVD, disc, blah blah blah, yada yada yada, um, it looks like where memory slots go in. But now, I mean, that's to indicate that the memory is here. You just push it that way and pull it up like that. And then there's a little box on the inside. It'll have a lever that's sitting down. So pull that lever up and then just pull it out. And there it is. There's the PlayStation memory card. The PlayStation memory. Look at that. Look at how dirty that is. That has collected dust over many, many years. Anyway, that's all. Just wanted to show you how to replace your PlayStation's PlayStation Slim Edition's memory. I don't have a PlayStation Super Slim. I used to. But I don't anymore, so I can't show you how to replace that one's memory figured out how to replace that one's memory too but still you're sitting on the screw but um yeah that's about it little tab here open the tab up or you can just take it off if you want to it's kind of like a little clip um and there should be a screw in there after that you can close it up after you unscrew it Tilt that that way. Sorry. Lift that up. Set that to the side. Lift the little clip up, just like that. And pull. It's kind of hard if it's an old PlayStation. And it's got dust in it, it's kind of hard. But if it's a new PlayStation and you just want to change the memory of it, you can just, just slightly pull it. And it should come out, but this is an old PlayStation, so it comes out with some force. But other than that, that's it. Oh, wait. Nope. You still need the uh, memory thing right here out. This is just the casing. You'll take the screws, the four screws here, out, and it should, and then the memory casing, and then the memory should just slide right out. I'm not going to do that because I have Minecraft downloaded on this. I mean, it works, but. I mean, it, the PlayStation works, but it doesn't read discs, so technically it doesn't. But yeah, I'm not going to do that because I have Minecraft downloaded on it and pretty important things on that. So, that's pretty much it. Peace!